Good morning, everyone. Hey, y'all. Hey. It's like, no, good morning, y'all. It is cold out here. <laughs> oh, it is so cold. Girl is back on her routine. Thank goodness. I know, I'm so hyped. But, y'all, it's cold. It's literally, it's in Jacksonville, Florida. It's 36 degrees outside, y'all. It's cold. Oh, shoot. I'm I'm trying to warm this car up so I can drop my off at the bus stop. She over here. <sighs> and she don't appreciate me taking her up to the bus stop late. Because it's cold. Who wants to stand outside waiting for a school bus? Wait. Well, who wants to stand outside because I missed the school bus? Man, you're not going to miss the school bus. See, here she go with this. <sighs> so, yeah, I hope everyone had a great weekend. I hope everyone is enjoying their time whenever you're watching this. But yeah, your girl is back. I'm back on my routine. I feel like my seat is moving. Maybe because I haven't I haven't driven since I think Saturday. Yeah, I haven't drove since Saturday. Back on my routine. Um I haven't been to the gym, y'all, in like a week and a half due to the fact that the children were um, out from school and I already explained that and also when they went back it was just chaotic the last two days they went back I had so much stuff to do this weekend I had to wash Maya's hair um, you know stuff like that and her hair takes forever and ever oh man alright Maya bye have a good day I love you and I'll see you later uh, let me uh, sunglasses on my face. Woo! It's cold. I'm happy to be talking to y'all. I miss y'all. I miss talking. So happy to be talking to you guys. I miss you. I'm back. I'm still doing 16 days of Ashley. I am. I'm a little behind. Just bear with me, y'all. I'm behind. I'm, I think I'm behind a day because I was not able to do any videos. Um, was it yesterday i couldn't do anything i had to cook i had to do hair you know anytime your car say low outside temperatures it's cold like it's cold and then if y'all got leather seats and it's cold oh my god thank god for seat warmers because my poor butt is cold <laughs> i can't stop saying it i haven't experienced this kind of weather in yet like since i moved down here like I moved up from north and it was cold like this. I, I moved away from that. Yeah, your girl is going to the gym. I'm going to take it slow because I, I haven't been to the gym in a week and a half. So I'm not going to do, I'm probably not going to record because I got to get back in the gym flow. Um, I'm not, I'm just going to do cardio. <clears throat> I'm probably going to do 30 minutes of cardio, um, some abs, and maybe some legs. I don't know. I'm probably going to do more abs because I've been eating like a little pig. I shouldn't say pig. That's kind of insulting. But I have been eating. Um, I have been eating some things that I shouldn't probably be eating. But like, you only live once. It's my birthday month. Well, it's not my birthday month because I'm not that type of person. I'm not <sighs> that narcissistic. Is that saying? Is that really saying narcissistic? Like when somebody celebrates their month, their birthday all month long? Because I'm not that type of person. I'm not once. I celebrate it one day if I'm able to, and that's it. And then I move on. I'm not, I'm not the same person like, oh, I need a whole week or a whole month. No, because God only gave me one day to come on this earth. So, yeah. But anyway, let me go, y'all, because I am rambling. And I'll see y'all on the flip side. Peace. So I'm done the gym, y'all. And my ear, it's like clogged or something. So I told you guys I wasn't doing I did I did the glider for 30 minutes and then I did some abs and I did the treadmill for 25 minutes. <sighs> I feel good that I'm a big I did go to the gym but I don't know I think I need to increase my weights y'all because when I was doing them abs on the machine I was like I could feel it but it wasn't like I normally feel it. So that mean I have to probably up either five pounds. I'm gonna up five pounds. I usually do like between 70, 80, and 90 is the max. I can do 90. No, I could do 90 on my legs. 
um when I do my leg work I can do up to 100 because my leg my bottom half is strong but yeah y'all head of this game y'all I look so pale y'all I don't think I'm nip I look real yellow washed out in this um camera today but yeah y'all it's cold it's like 38 degrees right now and it's like almost 11 o'clock in my house we don't eat pork but it's so cold and like hearty meals are very high in calories um i found this recipe it's a oprah oprah um she it's like some type of soup she made it's one of her recipes and it's it looks so good and tasty but i gotta get a lot of ingredients like you need fennel um chicken sausage and some other stuff but any of y'all got any like any of y'all fitness people that watch my channel got any like recipes that aren't cold because i'm the type of person i cannot eat cold food in the cold i have to have something warm um in my body because it's cold like i'm already anemic shoot i don't need to be any more colder than what i already get when i'm i'm not supposed to be but anyway if any of y'all got any ideas and any good recipes that don't have pork in it and that's not carb like something i like vegetarian stuff i'm not gonna lie like i'm like really like i was telling my daughter this morning that i'm thinking about i think i'm gonna become a vegetarian like because i found out something it's very interesting y'all i found out that um dairy well i already know i'm lactose intolerant i'm not supposed to eat dairy but i don't know what i could that's what i wanted to ask what can i substitute for my protein um that's not meat or eggs or dairy like because dairy gives me a lot of mucus y'all and i actually stopped eating like eggs i stopped eating eggs i, I don't drink milk i only drink almond milk because i drink almond milk but I don't even think that's good for you either. Maybe I should start drinking cashew milk. Um, what else? But yeah, let me. If any of y'all fitness people that like are like kind of vegan or vegetarian, let me know if y'all know a substitute that I can use for a protein um, to eat. Like, cause I I just can't the eggs things and the yogurt thing. It's just causing me so much phlegm in my throat and. Every morning when I wake up, I'm spitting, I'm spitting, I'm spitting. It's just nasty. I'm spitting it. It's just disgusting. And I'm always spitting. I got to spit all the time. So, I ha I think I'm going to just stop eating it. Yeah, and then I'm going to be more deficient than what I already am. <laughs> but let me know, y'all. And I'll talk to y'all later. But, y'all, it's like several hours <clears throat> later. It's like almost 3 o'clock. Yeah, I'm showered, relaxed. I had some phone calls to make. I mean, Elijah is actually on his way home from school. The school bus is on its way. If I got anything on my mouth, sorry, y'all. I'm eating crackers. But, y'all. Oh, yeah. And, by the way, this is my face without makeup. Y'all see all my blemishes. The redness on my face. I have emu oil actually on my face right now. I didn't put an SPF on because I actually am not going. I'm, I should probably wear it, but I'm not really going anywhere today. But to pick up Maya from practice later. And then I'm coming back home. But y'all, I'm stressing out. I mentioned to y'all that I'm going to be starting work, right? In order for me to actually start work or start this particular position i need this certain training and the place that i was referred to i've been calling them for like the last two and a half weeks and they have not returned any of my calls i've called different numbers so my next option is to take a visit up there and i'm not going to be able to do that until wednesday um because i just got news that my husband called me he needs the car for tomorrow and it's going to be all day long because i was going to go up there tomorrow but you know you know what it is so anyway it's just frustrating me like i really want to go back to work and this little piece of 
training that I need is eight weeks long. So it's going to take me eight weeks to get into the job <clears throat> before I can even get to the job. And I have to pass everything, which I will because I'm not, you know, once I'm into something, I can do it. I'm not like that type of person where I struggle with things. Um, if you read, it's common sense. So, I'm just a little frustrated. And it's been, like, really kind of a little bit stressing me. And, you know, my mom is always calling me, asking me, you know, am I did I talk to them? Did I hear anything? And it's starting to stress me. That part of it, and she's not understanding, like, I don't need you to ask me almost every day, like, if I heard anything from anybody. When I do, you'll be, like, the first I'll let know. And then the person that... Um, brought the, the the position to my attention will know too. I just, you know, I'm just like, I don't want to hear nothing. I don't hear nothing about this until these people call me. Y'all, I'm going crazy. It's driving me nuts. It's like a, and stuff like this when something I'm anxious and I want to do something, it affects my sleep pattern. Because all I can think about is, oh, well, maybe they'll call me tomorrow. If they don't call me, I'm going to call them. I even call, I call them twice. Still nothing. So, I don't know. And then I, my last resort is, I think tomorrow, I'm going to pray on this tonight. Well, I've been praying on it every night. But what I'm going to do is, tomorrow, I'm going to call the lady that referred me to the place and speak with her about it and see, you know, what else I could do or if she knows anything but if she doesn't, I'm still going to go up there and see if maybe I can fill out the application. You know, see what I have to do. Once I get my foot in the door, so, I'll So, hey, there. guys, I'm home. I was, I actually was talking, and then my mom called me. And then time I got off the phone with my mom, I might have gotten in the car. But, yeah, I'm home with my... She got hit with a soccer ball, y'all. And she want me to sit through that. Like, I'm already petrified because she already had two concussions. So, listen. She get another concussion. I'm going to go ham on her. I'm like, girl, you cannot play soccer. Matter of fact, it's going to be a vlog and a content video tomorrow. And I hope you guys are happy with the content video because I'm going to work really, really hard for you guys. Thank you guys for watching. And thanks for all the support. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate the feedback, the love. Um, it just motivates me even more to do more. So, and I that sounds so scripted, y'all. But I'm really, honestly, I'm very happy that I'm doing this. And I do get feedback. And it means a lot. Because at least I know somebody watching me. It's tomorrow. Look forward to a vlog and a content video so i'll be up to date with 16 days of ashley tomorrow um and then so forth and so forth you know everything will fall into play um yeah i just i told you guys this has been hectic i'm trying to get back on my schedule and i told i explained to you guys earlier about my sleep pattern it's changed because it has changed only because you know i have that situation on my mind so just keep me in your prayers and pray that everything go great and just pray for me y'all so talk to you tomorrow peace